Hey beautiful people, thank you so much for tuning into my channel. My name is Janine, also known as Jay Stella, and today's video is going to be on my wig collection. A lot of them are pretty inexpensive and also all synthetic wigs. I have a thing where whenever I feel like dyeing my hair or cutting my hair or just switching it up in a drastic way, I just buy a wig because I have not put any chemicals or any heat to my hair in over two years and so I just don't want to ruin the curls. That is why I get the wigs. I think they're so much fun. Ahead. I am so, not teaching you guys how to put them on because I'm still learning myself but just showing you guys what I have. And just a side note, if you do like how my foundation looks in this video, it is fully drugstore foundation and I will link that in the cards and in the description box as well. And so yeah, we will get right into the video. So this was my first wig that I ever bought. I called her Tracy. She was was blonde and beautiful she used to be really long but I thought that I could cut hair on my own which Lord knows I cannot I'm not a professional hairstylist so I don't know what I was thinking when I did that but I got this for like 40 bucks on Amazon and it's actually really good it has three clips inside and a small lace front right here which is great if you want to make it look a little bit more realistic and a band so for the price that's not bad at all so what I like Oh Lord, <laughs> this is funny. So here we have her, and, but it's, it was a lot of fun. I just wanted to try to get my hair blonde and this is it. Here we have one of my favorites. She's long, she's blonde, she's a little curly. Um, however, I will say I've worn it like four times and now it's getting really, really naughty. But the problem with this one, and again, I will link all of them below, is that it doesn't have any clips in the front. It's a full lace front and then the clips are on the bottom. So this one I have to wear with a hat because I still don't know how to lay down a wig like 100% to not feel like it's gonna fly off. So let me show you guys. Let me go brush it. <laughs> All right, you guys. So this one is a favorite just because the color is so nice and like the roots are dark. So like even if my baby hairs are out, like you can't really tell. That is what I really, really like about this one. The problem is, is like since I can't secure the front, like it slips. Like look. So I always wear a hat with it because I am scared that this girl's gonna be like whoo like that. So that's the wig. And This one is not that good. Um, it is another one that has the clips inside and it also has um, this little little band thing. I just gotta hook it up. And the clips are always good because they always make sure it stays in place. And then like that little small lace front also helps it look a little bit more natural. However, this color is just too dark and it looks really fake. Um, so yeah, let's try this on. So I want to show you the extent of this wig. It's really long, as you can see. And um, this one would be actually be pretty good for like a costume, I feel. So there's that. And another thing that I think I should do is put some dry shampoo to take away a little bit of the shine. That's another trick that you guys can do. Um, so basically what you do is you And now it's all white, but you gotta just work it in. And when you do that, it just helps the hair look a little bit more natural. So I will get back. So here we have this cute little bob. And when I bought it, I didn't realize that this is like a full, full wig. And it doesn't have the clips. It only has the clip. It doesn't have any clips, actually. It doesn't have any clips. And so I need the clips. But I didn't return it because I was just like, whatever. So let's try this one on. So even though it doesn't have any clips, um, I feel like it's pretty secure in that sense. So let's just appreciate that this wig makes me look like someone's really cool rich auntie, but I'm not. <laughs> so I like this wig because it already has like little baby hairs cut out for you. So you don't really have to go out of your way to like make the wig look extra real. 
but I like it. I think it's so cute. What do you guys think? This is I really wanted to get a pink wig, but then I told myself, you know what, let me ease into it. So I got a really pretty burgundy wig, has little curls, and has a little side part right here. So um, this one does have the clips in the front, which I love, and then that lace part in the middle for wherever you do the um, your part. So this is a good one, and let me try it out for you guys. Honestly, like if I could dye my hair this color and it looked this fire all the time, I would. The problem is when you dye your hair this color and you wash it, it bleeds out, so it's a lot of maintenance. So here we have, I want to call this one Celine, but I also feel like Kim Possible a little bit. I know that's weird, but yeah, I really, really like this one. So here you guys go. Yes. All right, you guys, that was the end of my wig collection video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, a like, and subscribe. If you have any video recommendations, please let me know in the comments down below, and I will see you guys next week. Bye-bye.